Hey everyone, welcome to another bonus episode of the New Marketing Show. Thanks for catching us on Instagram TV, wherever you get this. So today, uh, maybe I'll be a little bit off topic, but it all relates to business, and I think that it relates to our personal life and with a lot of other things in life. That a lot of times, you know, you need to set boundaries when it comes to different relationships. And here I'm talking strictly professional relationships. You know, I just got off a great coaching call with a nutritionist that I work with, my friend Laura Ripsis, <clears throat> and follow her, Coach Laura Fit. But at, aside from that, we talked about what brings stress on, what brings stress on to people, what brings stress on to businesses. And the number one thing that I could pinpoint is that stresses me out the most is boundaries, lack of boundaries. You know, you can't, you, you can't expect everybody to understand that you have professional boundaries, you know, maybe getting calls or texts early on a Saturday morning or maybe late at night, <clears throat> et cetera, et cetera. You know, but it's how you respond to that and how you react to that and how you address it the next day. Or you do respond and you say, hey, you know, I'm out of office right now. It's okay to say you are out of office. You know, in this day of us being super uber connected to every single thing that we do, it's okay to say you're not available. Now, that's the one that I've always struggled with is saying that I'm not available because I don't want people to think like, oh, I don't have time for them or, oh, I can't handle the business or or, I'm not tending to what they need. But what I'm really saying is I'm just not available right now. I will get back to you, but I'm just not available to do it right now. And those boundaries and when you set those boundaries and when you set maybe more and when I I'll say I you know, start to set, set more stricter business hours and business response times, what happens is some of that stress goes away. And not only will the stress go away, the stress isn't caused by that phone call. The stress is caused with me of what I'm not getting done because now I'm flipping gears and going somewhere else. So boundaries in every single thing. It's like scope creep. You wouldn't let a client creep, you know, on your scope of work. And if you do, shame on you. You should stop now. But if you set <clears throat> the scope boundaries, you also need to set time and correspondence boundaries of when you're available to get back to somebody and when you will. And when you, uh, whenever you say you're going to get back to them, just get back to them. So, hey, thanks for checking us out. Thanks for watching. We'll be back on track with some more episodes of the New Marketing Show. Kevin and I have been busy recording a bunch of stuff. So, see you soon.